Hey, hey, what's going on, everybody? Yeah, I'm looking at this bright yellow shirt. I'm not sure how it's gonna look on camera. But anyway, I wanted to talk about wholesaling, wholesale license versus retail license. You know, um, people who come to me sometimes her, uh, already have a wholesale license and they're you know trying to get a uh, license to be able to sell retail. Um, and, and why do people start with the wholesale license first? Well, because it's easier to get. Typically, most states will have a lower bar for you to jump over. Uh, a lot of times, you can even do it from your office in your home, in your apartment, wherever. You don't have to get a commercial location. So the wholesale license, wholesale licenses, you know, it's easier to get. And, um, and it still gives you a dealer plate in a lot of instances, all right? So people want that dealer plate and, of course, access to the dealer auctions. But you only can sell the dealers. That's what wholesale means. Oh, that's a deer. Wow. You only can sell the dealers. All right? So we're going to make, what, two, three, four hundred, maybe five hundred bucks if you're only selling to other dealers. You're wholesaling. All right? You're not able to sell to the retail market, which are your consumers, the public. Where you're gonna be able to make twelve hundred, two thousand, twenty five hundred dollars or more per vehicle. No. Retail license. All right. So you can start out with the wholesale license. Yes, make some money and learn the business. Learn how it is to you know do your own titles and the process of the auctions and you know you can do very well with a wholesale license as well. I mean, if you're getting cars at sub wholesale meaning you're able to you can even find people off of craigslist you can find people who you see the ad on craigslist selling a car you send them a message hey i offer you dealer dealer trading for your car and i made a video about that so you get enough people if you do it consistently enough you'll get people who are willing to sell you their car for a sub wholesale below wholesale right and then you turn around and you know you have your network of dealers that you sell your cars to and you can do a few cars a week that way and make your money in transactions. A wholesaler makes his money on more transactions. A retailer is making his money a little bit slower maybe, but the transactions are bigger because he's selling directly, directly to the public. When you're selling to a dealer, a dealer receives your inventory, then he or she in turn sells directly to the public. All right? So that's the difference. The auto regulation that we're in it's highly regulated uh, licensing and permit license is just the permission to be able to do something and the state says if you get this piece of paper right you're permit you're able to do XYZ in the auto sales industry in the auto arena all right so if you have a wholesale license now and you're trying to uh, you see that you want to you know be able to sell to a retail market you know, get back to me. You know, we create deal licenses. You know, we're in a couple of states now. We're doing Florida, Georgia, Maryland. But pretty much, if you give me a call and you give me what state that you're in, I mean, because the procedures are basically basically the same, and so we can, um, you know, take care of you. So actual license, retail license, which requires a location, a commercial location, more often than not, a test you got to take or is taken for you, et cetera, et cetera. The insurance blah 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 all right so again that's the difference between a wholesale license and retail license wholesale license you can typically depending on what state you're in work from home and your out-of-pocket expenses 1500 1700 bucks total and you get one plate even and you're able to register with the auctions all right but you only can sell to other dealers or you're buying cars and you're putting them right back into the auction Right, the people who do that, they're only selling within the auctions. So, all right, that's something that you think about, and um, you know, you may, maybe you want to just you know shift your business and get back and get into retail. All right, so my contact is on the bottom. Sorry about the bright yellow shirt. <laughs>